This video is for a 2003 Teton, Teton Homes 39 foot Freedom. Just want to walk around the outside showing that there's no major dings, dents, no malfunctions. This is a fiberglass unit. First thing you'll notice it, it has the uh, drop down uh, storage. That's kind of unique. In a 2003, this would have been one of the first coaches to put the drop down frame. Uh, that gives you over 140 cubic feet of storage. The other thing that you'll notice right over here, uh, this unit does have a 2,000 watt inverter. Very unique, okay? It's got the slam bag doors. A lot of units just today are adding those. You know, this is a 2003, a lot of units today, that's just a, a, an ad form. Walk around the outside, very nice unit. This, Vic, this unit does have a Kingdom satellite. You'll notice it's got a rear ladder. Hydraulic slides. It's got electric jacks in the back. Come around over here. I thought this was kind of unique again for the year. This is a 2003. It does have uh, hydraulic brakes. That's kind of unique. Step in here. Also, we've got an electric awning on the outside. First thing you notice when you walk inside, it just has a lot of room, very spacious. You know, it's got the center island, which again, there, there's a lot of, I think a lot of uh, uh, units today might have robbed their ideas off of this company because in 2003, this would have been definitely way, way above everybody else. You know, such a cut ahead. This unit would have stickered somewhere in the range of $90,000. That's how expensive this was. You come on in the uh, kitchen area, solid surface countertops, you'll notice right away, real deep, bold sinks, very deep. Most coaches, the sinks are only half of that depth. Looks like they're about eight to nine inches deep, very nice. Come over here, we've got a dishwasher. Okay, very unique to a lot of, you know, to coaches like this. That's, you don't see that all the time. You've got a microwave three burner cooktop with an oven for whatever reason a lot of coaches are getting away ovens getting away with you know they're not putting in the ovens anymore uh, this does have a 12 cubic foot refrigerator with an ice maker come over here it's got a TV that's built in that might be slightly dated so you know something like that may need to be replaced or you go out and get a converter box no big deal you've got a desk area this is really nice you know, this drops down, you got a nice uh, computer desk to work at. Also, I think there'd be plenty of space if you wanted to. You could probably even add a fireplace down there. You know, that would be something. Uh, like I said, it does have an in-motion satellite. You come back over here. This is kind of unique. I haven't really seen one. i got to be honest with you. I've never seen one with a rear dinette. Um, I think it's kind of cool. You can sit here and actually look out the back. Um, especially depending on where you, you park this unit at, if you have a nice view, boy, that'd be kind of neat. Uh, this does have another leaf that goes in the center. There's two more tape chairs that goes go with the unit. If you notice how the cabinetry goes right to the roof, that's an indication of a higher end coach. What I mean by that is the cabinetry, when it's touching the roof like that, that means it was only made for this coach. When you go over to Elkhart and some of those coaches over there, I'm not going to name names, if you notice, the cabinetry does not meet the roof line. The reason why that is is because they're putting the cabinets in a whole bunch of different coaches. This coach, the cabinet, was just for that. Solid oaks. That's kind of nice. And it does have a ceiling fan on it. Just lots of room inside here. Come over here. The unit does have uh, duo thermo. So it's got a heat pump. This unit has two furnaces on it. So definitely can cover whatever cold weather you're looking for. This is definitely a Four Seasons coach. It does have a solar panel on it. Okay, that's the inverter. The inverter's here. We do have a solar panel on this unit also. Go to the bathroom. It has a separated bathroom. Close the door behind you. You come over to the shower. It's got a one-piece shower. Very nice. This unit has two fantastic fans in it. One up here in the bedroom. There's also one down in the kitchen. Corian tops. Lots of cabinet space everywhere around here. You'll notice that everywhere around here. Lots of cabinet space. That's cedar lined. You got lots of drawers in here. It's got a queen size bed. This unit does have a central vac system. Oh, here, this is kind of cool. 
come over here you've got a washer and a dryer okay separate it you know there's no doubt about it this will work better than those combo units you notice too there's duct work everywhere lots of heat and air vents all through this unit this is the bedroom and there's four vents up in here or no I'm sorry six vents up in here lots of lots of vents I'm six foot four I have absolutely no problem standing inside this unit okay lots of headroom plenty of space lots of area in here when you get up in the morning take your time relax you know change your clothes there's a lot of space in here you've got probably close to eight feet from the end of the bed to the first step there's a door that closes that off so this separates your areas this is definitely a coach that was made for a couple um, occasionally bringing someone over it does have a hide a bed uh, but really made for a couple you know this is definitely something that uh, uh, that you would take out full time and get away from it all so if you have any questions about the unit please give me a call my phone number is 888-310-7744 my name is Mike Simpkins my email address is mike at gtwrv.com that's gtwrv.com you can also see our units on the web at www.gtwrv.com. Give me a buzz.